Masters, brought to you by Kenner. Welcome back to yet another Transformers review. Today we're going to cover Robots in Disguise Car Robots Mirage. Here is Mirage, he's awesome. Yet another indie car. Although it's not a 38. What the heck happened? 37 numbers are lost. It's just number one now. Must have won enough races to get that number. Very interesting though, he does have an Autobot symbol here. Which means he is the master release. If he was released in Japan, it would not have been there. Would have been gone. Hmm. Do you like the idea? It says TM Transformers right there on the back. Just in case you didn't know he's a Transformer. Do you like it? It's very awesome. He is a F1 Indy car, if you did not know what this thing was. Very metallic. There's a real nice pearl going on. Pearly, pearly, pearl, pearl, pearl. Lots of pearl. Do you like the way they faded this red to just kind of blend in and go away? It's almost a pink here, which is kind of cool. The way it fades. Do you like the deco? It's very awesome. Although mine is worn a little teeny tiny bit here, but that's due to time. It happens. But anyhow, it's got a lot of detail in the back. Even where a uh, ejection parachute would pop out just in case you couldn't slow down the car. Pretty cool. Let's go into transformation. Flip down the hood. Pop his legs. And then we're going to gently stick our fingernails in here and pull these bits out. And there we go. There's Mirage in robot mode. Do you like the idea they picked out his legs with some blue? Could have just left it white, but they didn't. Do you like his head sculpt doll? Very, very interesting looking head sculpt. Do you like that? It's very cool. Would have been nice if there was some light piping, but there's not. I find it odd that Hot Shots the only one gets light piping. It's very weird. But, very cool. Anyway, if you guys tune in tomorrow, we'll cover another one. <laughs> Bye for now.